Hello everyone, welcome to another video on the Fox Tech YouTube channel. This time we talk about the Memoji on your iPad and how you can make sure that it actually moves with your face. I need to explain that to you right now. So we are inside of the uh, the uh, messages app. I started a new message and you can see some things like some of the icons are available in here. In case you don't see the icons under the text field like the photos, app store, Apple cache, whatever, you probably didn't click on the A icon. So in case you don't see anything, tap on the A icon. And you can see two different things. When you click on it, it enlarges, and one of them is Memoji, and the other is stickers. And the basic difference between them is that stickers basically don't move. Uh, these are also created by your personal Memoji and stuff, but these don't move. When you click on that, you can only add it. It's a sticker, it doesn't move but the one icon next to it is called Memoji. By the way, guys, if you want to know everything about your iPhone apps, you have to click the link down below in the description. It's a 100% free education platform where I publish like video editing courses. There is going to be the All Apps Explained course, which is coming up. It's going to explain every single app on your iPhone. It's going to be really cool. So go ahead and check out that link. It's free to access. So yeah, go ahead and do that right now. And when you click on that, you can see that it shows and tracks my face. And right now, as I speak to, to the thing, you can see I can switch it to a different one, do whatever I want. And in this case, my iPad is browsing my face. You can see without it, it when I cover the camera, it doesn't have the option to see me. So it doesn't track me or anything like that. Now it can track me. And this is basically the difference. Memojis are the, the moving ones and stickers are just not moving. So you can see it doesn't matter which one you pick from, even from the built-in ones, it doesn't matter. You can also tap on the record button. So right now I can say whatever, whatever I want. As you can see right here, I have the 30 seconds limit, the countdown, which is showing me what is possible, what's not. So yeah, that's basically how, how it works. And yeah, that is basically the difference between moving emojis and an emojis. Cause yeah, the memoji or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. The, the naming is a bit more complicated, but just make sure that this one with the, you know, with the yellow like frame inside of that icon is just to make sure that you can also move and it tracks your face. The stickers are not the same way on the other hand. So yeah, that's the difference. That's how it works. And that's basically how you can make your memojis move with your face on your iPad. So basically you don't use stickers, you use memojis, you record yourself and send it as a message. That's basically how it works. So yeah, that's about it. I'm going to wrap up this video right now. If you found it useful, make sure to leave a thumbs up under this video, but definitely subscribe down below so you never miss future content and we can see each other in the future. Thanks a lot for watching. See you guys later. Peace out until then.